It's Anime Sensei here again, and I welcome you to another exciting episode of What We Do Best, recommending 10 dope anime for your viewing pleasure. Today, we'll be talking about 10 anime where the main character is an overpowered swordsman. If you love sword fights and some good old historic action that may or may not be mixed with superpower, then this video is for you. And the series on this list provide well-animated swords fights and an overpowered protagonist to thrill you. Beginning from the bottom, we have... 10. Korozuka. So we start off with Korozuka, a 2008 anime by Studio Madhouse. This anime doesn't tone down the gore and violence. It's quite hardcore, featuring lots of action, horror, sci-fi, and vampire action. On the softer side, there's a growing romance that you'll find quite amusing, and the historical feel of the anime is mind-grabbing. Set in the 12th century, the story focuses on Kuro. He's the brother to Yorimoto, who will eventually become the first shogun to rule over all of Japan. After Kuro loses to his brother, he flees to the mountain, and this is where this series diverts from actual history, as he was recorded to have committed suicide. Anyways, after fleeing to the mountain, he meets a strange woman and falls in love with her, and they begin to live together. She has some dark secrets, and soon he finds out that he's now immortal. From his abode in the mountain, he will live for a thousand years, watching Japan evolve into its modern self. Nine, Tales of Zestiria the Cross. Tales of Zestiria the Cross sits firmly on our ninth spot. Ufotable delivers some stunning animation again, as they've become known to always do. The action, adventure, and fantasy anime centers on a world with divine beings known as seraphims. The seraphims, as a race, give blessings to humans, while in turn the humans offer prayers to them. Humans with the ability to interact with them are known as shepherds. The young boy, Sori, lives in the village of Elysia, along with some seraphims. Mikleo is his childhood seraphim companion, and together they will investigate some ruins to satisfy their curiosity. However, this chance move will lead Sori to a young girl seeking a shepherd to save the world. With a lot of things going on in this fantasy world, the end goal of our heroes is a world where humans and seraphims can live peacefully. 8. Shironiko Project Zero Chronicles You might not have heard about this anime. It's not so good, and it's still fairly new, airing its 12 episodes in 2020. Some people say things are not always white or black. However, that's not the case in this world, as the world is divided into two kingdoms. The kingdom of white that floats in the skies, and the kingdom of black that habits the desolate lands below. The major players in this anime are Queen Iris, ruler of the kingdom of white, and a mysterious boy from the kingdom of black whose village just got wiped off by monsters. There's a threat from the kingdom of evil, and these two heroes must challenge these evil forces on their own terms, and maybe, just maybe, fate will bring them together to defeat the forces of evil. 7. Plunderer This fantasy anime doesn't shy away from action. Premiering in 2020, we see the world of Alsia through the eyes of Hina, exploring all the mysteries, myths, and legends it has to offer. The world of Alsia is weird and unique for the fact that power and social status are determined by the numbers engraved on a person's body, known as counts. In this world, where the count is everything, there are some people whose count has a white star next to it. These are the heroes of that great war that ravaged the Earth centuries ago. As Hina goes on her mission to fulfill her mother's dying wish, she encounters one of these men, and the rest, as they say, is history. 6. Kimi Toboku no Saigo no Senjo Arui wa Seika ga Hajimaru Seisen This anime's title is translated to mean Our Last Crusade or The Rise of a New World. Produced by Silverlink Studio in 2020, it features a world where astral power has begun to spread. The Empire is scared of the destructive capabilities of this power and so begins to oppress and torment the mages that can wield it. Some mages escape and form the Nebula Sovereignty. With both kingdoms now at war, something that will change the world forever happens. The revered knight Iska commits a treasonous crime of freeing an imprisoned witch. He's in turn imprisoned, until he's suddenly released under a condition that he will hunt down the woman known as the Ice Calamity Witch. Iska wishes for peace in the world, and he'll do anything to achieve it. The Ice Calamity Witch feels the same way too, and so she will do everything within her power to bring down the aggressive empire. Watch this fantasy action series to find out what happens next. 
5. Hagure Yusha no Aesthetica, a 2012 anime by Studio Arms. It consists of action, fantasy, and some of that good, edgy stuff that anime fans love so much. The discovery of Salmon Syndrome, 30 years ago, allowed young people to travel to fantasy worlds and parallel universes. However, upon returning back to their world, some were able to retain the special abilities they got in these other worlds. Akatsuki Osawa is popularly known as the rogue hero. He returns from his fantasy world with a young girl known as Miyu. She is the daughter of the Demon Lord in the fantasy world he was in. They both enroll in Babel, a special school for those with superpowers. And while there will be a lot of obstacles on their own, the duo will stop at nothing to uncover the mysteries that plague this school. Four, Hakuoki, also known as Hakuoki Demon of the Fleeting Blossom. It's a 2010 anime by Studio Dean. It focuses on genres like action, drama, supernatural, and historical. If you love those heavy sword swings and swift slashes characterized by samurai fights, then this anime is for you. A young girl named Chizuru is searching for her father who's been away on a job and she's not heard from him in months. She witnesses a horrifying scene as soon as she arrives in Kyoto, and soon she finds herself a captive of the Shinsegumi. It turns out that the Shinsegumi are also searching for her father, and soon she'll get dragged into the political conflict that circles Kyoto and the war between the Shinsegumi and their enemies. 3. Inuyasha Inuyasha is a classic that began in the year 2000. The anime by Studio Sunrise can be said to be one of those that brought in people into the culture. Inuyasha touches on everything, ranging from supernatural elements like demons and monsters to other more love genres like action, adventure, fantasy, comedy, romance, and historical. Kagome is a 15-year-old that now finds herself back 500 years in the Sengoku era. The Shikon Jewel now resides inside her, and it's a jewel desired by a powerful demon. After this jewel shatters, the young girl and her band of adventurers must now now collect the shards, preventing them from falling into the wrong hands. 2. Noragami Noragami is one of those anime that succeeds in doing everything right. The action is amazing, the comedy is witty and fits into the show, and the adventure embodies the shounen spirit. The supernatural elements in this show are now lost on the viewer. Studio Bones hit old with this one. Yato is a minor deity that spends his time doing odd jobs for 5 yen. His partner gets fed up of him and leaves. But that's when his life changes. Hiyori manages to survive an accident that she saves Yato from, and now she discovers that her soul can now leave her body. In order to fix her, Yato needs a a partner and she'll team up with him in his quest to get a new partner. 1. Berserk Holding down the top spot is Berserk, and for obvious reasons. Berserk is one of those anime that reinforces the belief that manga is heads and shoulders above anime, because in this case, the anime just doesn't do justice to the source material which everyone regards as a masterpiece. Guts is now marked for death, wielding the Dragon Slayer Blade. He must destroy all the monsters coming after him while he seeks vengeance on a former friend and a man he once looked up to. Berserk is a household name in the anime and manga community, and this gore fest is one that will stand the test of time. Time. 's the end of this video swordsmen abound in anime and so these are just a few of the ones I can recommend now I hope you enjoyed the video and do let me know your thoughts in the comments section below.